Hello everyone, this is Luxury PL38. Today I would like to unbox, to do an unboxing on Dior. As you can see, this is the Dior. And um, obviously they still have the um, holiday packaging and I was given by my SA the holiday packaging, thanks to her. And um, I've just purchased this a couple of days ago, but um, I haven't got a chance to unbox it. So this is an actual unboxing. I've seen the bag itself, and I believe it is the last of that color in the whole of Canada, as I was being informed by my SA, so I grabbed it. It is the 30 Montant, the original 30 Montant, but apparently it is in Indian, rose color so let's get to it as you can see the beautiful um, packaging she has done marvelous job um, my SA at Dior okay and um, I love how she always put um, that on top okay this is beautifully wrapped look at how gorgeous she wrapped that up and that's the receipt okay and let me just put those away but I would like to emphasize on this apparently there was a price increase and it is not minor increase it is a huge increase and I was shocked and this is also another reasons why I purchased this I was being informed by my SA at Dior that all the monogram items has received a dramatic increase and um, let me show you this this is my box bag 30 montant this was an increase because it was only released a couple of months ago but the regular size monogram which is the original monogram that was the, for the 30 montant that was first released last year that has received a tremendous increase more than 10 percent it was i believe originally retail for 3900 canadian when it was released um towards the spring last year but it has increased to 4400 canadian dollars that is 500 dollars canadian so that's more than 10%. And that's not just one of the item. Apparently, most of the monogram item are so popular that it has increased dramatically in price. I At that time when I purchased this, I have a choice of getting the regular 30 Montant um, in blue, in navy blue, but I chose the box back because it was a sought after. I purchased this a month ago and I have my video which I did unboxing and everything and comparison with the mini rectangular. Um, so if you can um, click through my previous video, there is an unboxing and a comparison with mini rectangular for this bag. So um, I kind of, well, I had a mixed feeling that I should have gotten that one first because at that time it was 3,900 and this is 3,600 but there is a 300 differences and at that time I should have realized that that 300 differences is not going to last long because the truth is it didn't the price has been increased for the regular size the bigger one from 3,900 has been increased to 4,400 Canadian I was shocked good news is only the monogram one has increased so as soon as i heard that i immediately purchased the non-monogram one because it is in one of my wish lists and i'm sorry if i babble too much and i hope this information is to get to as many people as they can because this has not been increased only the monogram one so this is the packaging again it's really marvelous she did a good job kudos to my essay at Dior boutique okay and this is the cruise collection colors because I've actually seen this before 
it is um, it comes in the same color and it has a saddle bag and a turkey montan um, with this color they call it Indian rose I believe from what I um, received um, I, I was being told that that's what it was called an Indian rose if I'm not mistaken I'm sorry to do this but I actually have to use look at how gorgeous it is I'm gonna see if I can stretch this out sorry if I took longer than necessary to just open this it is very tight okay and this is what it looks like and I am just gonna put the box aside and I'm gonna show you what this gorgeous Teddy Montan bag this is in um, smooth ladder well the equivalent to Chanel lambskin ladder and um, this is in Indian rose I believe that's what they call it and it comes in the let me just pull that out okay that's the shoulder strap to show you the inside there's a zip pocket here and that's the um, Authenticity card. As usual, um, they do have a um, stamp here, and that's where I purchased it from, and the date, and uh, this is the receipt. And um, this was actually retail for four thousand. Let me just quickly show you. Um, it is retail for. 4550 Canadian dollars and um, it was retail for that price when it was launched during the cruise collections so there is no price adjustment or increase as of today as of January the 26th because only the monogram one which is this has increased in price but not the box bag I'm talking about the regular monogram 30 montage and um, there's quite a few around and that has increased even the monogram in the small ladder goods has increased as well so just to be aware that most of the monogram for Dior has increased in price it was a very harsh decision because the essay was being informed on that day itself so that they don't have any um, knowledge prior to that day and that's also the reasons why they did not uh, pass on to their clients and um, but this wasn't increased so it's still four thousand five hundred and fifty Canadian dollars and I will say in time they will increase this because the monogram one is 4400 whereas the ladder one is 4550 so as you can see there is only a hundred dollars over differences and this in time will definitely increase because it is in ladder however the essay told me that the monogram are so popular that's the reasons why Dior did a price increase, a price adjustment for all the mo most of the monogram items, including the small leather goods. So let's get into the bag itself. It has the um, for the shoulder strap. It looks like a belt, and basically, you need to put that in. I don't really want to use it as a clutch um, because personally I prefer to use it as a shoulder bag and I believe they do still have the plastic intact or is that just because it looks like there is a plastic intact I'm not sure it 
looks like it's got a plastic intake, but I have to look closely. So what you usually do is with the 30 Montan, you put, put it right through. And you can adjust it here and you can put put through the um, put through it like a belt and um, you can adjust this and because of that you can use this bag as a shoulder bag or as a cross body but um, I it is one of my wish lists to get the regular 30 Montan bag and so I um, I purchased this and I hope that um, well I know for sure that it, it's only a matter of time before they do a price adjustment so in reality I actually save a little bit hoping that you know I, I will save quite a fair bit I don't know how much they're going to increase this in the future but the 30 Montan bag as you can see that's the bottom and that's the bag. It has the 30 Montan, which is standard, spell out. And you can use the back pocket. Um, they're very tight. So I won't suggest um, for you to put a lot of, um, you know, bulky things in here because they're very tight. And I can show you how tight it is. Okay, see how I can only pull that much. So they're really tight. And um, I'm sorry if I did not show you the whole thing on the inside. Let me just quickly show you again. There is a front pocket here. And um, there is a zip pocket at the back. And basically that's about it. This is 